Hey what's up guys, Jake here, and today I'm going to be filling in for Hex Technology. In this video I'll be showing you what you need to do if you want to get iOS Beta 1 when it comes out this Monday, or June 2nd. So basically what we'll be doing is registering our UDID through a site so that we don't have to pay $100 for a developer account from Apple. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Alright, so first off you want to go ahead and get on your computer. Once you're here, go ahead and jump into your browser. And now you want to type in udidregistrations.com or I'll just leave it down in the description as a link so you can click on it from there. Once you're here, you want to go ahead and hit buy now and it will uh, take you to the page where you get to see all your options. So here you have bronze, bronze plus, silver, and gold. So once you've decided which package you want to go with, go ahead and click buy now and this will take you to the next page where you have to put in your email address. This, will be able, this way they'll be able to contact you when your UDID is registered. Next, you'll have to type in your UDID. If you're not sure where to find it, just open up iTunes and make sure your device is plugged in via USB. Now with that done, click on your device in iTunes and it'll show your serial number. Click that once and your UDID will pop up. Now you won't be able to copy and paste it, so you'll have to just do it the old-fashioned way and type it all out. From there, you choose how you want to complete your purchase. In my case, I use PayPal, which is probably the easiest method, but once you click on it, it's pretty much self-explanatory from there. Now if there's some reason that you have an issue, be sure to comment down below letting us know. Now once you've completed your purchase, you should get an email notifying you that your UDID has been registered. And now you're ready to download iOS 8 when it comes out on June 2nd. And that's it for this video guys, I hope it helped you out, and also be sure to stay tuned for more iOS 8 coverage this week. Thanks for watching, and I'll be sure to catch you all on the next one.